More drama in the cable news world, this time at CNN. CEO Chris Licht making headlines for a feature in The Atlantic, which pulls back the curtain on what's going on behind the scenes of a tumultuous year for that network. Licht has been critical of CNN's performance under his predecessor and wants to create a reset with Republican voters. But CNN's town hall with former President Trump last month did the opposite and dropped ratings to new lows. So joining me now is News Nation media analyst Colby Hall. Colby, thank you so much for your time. Uh, this is a pretty extensive profile of Licht uh, in the Atlantic. It goes in quite a few different directions, but is there a clear reason why things seem to be really on a downslide at that network? I think there's a few reasons, frankly. I think um, I think Chris Licht had a mission to try to bring CNN away from partisan advocacy journalism and bring it to the middle. Um, and he inherited a network, which he has said was sort of a, a gut renovation because the sort of anti-Trump DNA is still very much a part of the journalistic network there. Um, I think also he didn't do himself any favors by coming across occasionally as aloof. His critics would call him arrogant and not really sort of um, glad-handing and coddling a lot of the staff, talent, producers that work there. I think also CNN is revealing itself to be filled with a lot of staff members who are not afraid to stick their knives in the back of their boss. It's, it's really a stunning thing to see publicly play out. 15,000 words that basically paints the new CEO as a huge sort of uh, pariah within the network he's charged to turn around. I, I don't know how he quite does this, um, but we'll see. I don't think the story is yet done. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.